Hey, hello everybody, and welcome to Nexomon. I really, really don't have a whole lot of knowledge about this game other than it is essentially a monster catcher, monster tamer, monster battler. And I am very excited to jump into this. Now, uh, for those of you who were around for the monster harvest, we're taking a small break from that. We're gonna beat Nexomon, and then we're gonna revisit Monster Harvest where we left it off. Uh, sorry, some of you recognize it more as Planable Planet. We'll be revisiting Planable Planet slash Monster Harvest once we beat Nexomon, giving Monster Harvest some more time to really gather some steam, gather some more updates, more content, hopefully. And you know, we'll jump into a couple more episodes with that before we jump on to the next thing after that. But anyway, this is Nexomon. Let us see what we have to do with this. Uh, clearly, we're going to be a female. We're always a female because the female characters are usually better than the male characters. That's just a common fact. Long, long ago, this world once belonged to us, the humans. We were the rulers and masters of this land in this era of prosperity. <sighs> but then, on one fateful day, everything changed. <laughs> one fateful day, everything changed. Isn't that how it always is? Uh. From the high heavens descended an unspeakable evil, a creature. A monster. Why is it always unspeakable evil? He proclaimed what? himself as Omnicron, the king of the Nexomon. Omnicron. At least we got a cool name for our boss. This wicked behemoth threatened to engulf our humanity into darkness. Some nice art here. With one shattering roar, an eternal war between humans and Nexamon began. Over centuries of violence, humans learned how to tame and befriend the Nexamon and use them to fight against Omnicron himself. So cute! Then, in the midst of a dark age, one brave human warrior rose against all odds. And with the help of his Nexamon companions, he defeated Omnicron. So an epic tale. The war ended, and centuries later, we live in a peaceful Is world. Is that Robin Hood? With our Nexamon friends. For Omnicron's darkness was forever destroyed. Or so we thought. Or so we thought. <laughs> Present day. That's ominous. This is the end of your journey, champion of mankind. My ascension has been set in motion millennia before you were even born into this petty land. None may overcome Omnicron, the almighty king of the Nexomon. On this fateful day, my kind will arise from the ashes of your world. Now be gone! Well, that was intense. Our story begins with a young and normal human child. Little does she know, her life is about to change very, very soon. Very, very soon. Like how we have just that one, like, 
curly Q hair. That's a different color. Ah, the faces thing again. Investigate the mysterious noise downstairs. Okay. Um, this is fine. No. Cool. What's this? Cool. So if it's shiny, we can investigate and get something from it. Okay, cool. What's in our bag? Nothing. Nothing. A golden nexo trap. Yeah, I don't know either. So yes, welcome to our next adventure with the Nexomons. The device is performing marvelously, sir. It's most certainly ready for distribution, shall we? I will be the judge of that. Show it to me now. Absolutely, please follow me. Well, that guy doesn't look evil or anything. Oh my, did the noise wake you up, dear? There's nothing to be concerned about, for it is merely another test of our latest invention. I love how our parents' names are mother and father. That reminds me, I believe Ellie has been looking for you, dear. Why don't you go out and find her? She probably wants to show you her new toy. How very exciting. There's a shiny on the table. We got a potion. Very nice. Alright. Let's go find our friend, Ellie. Who's Ellie? Stay away from us! You can't take Atlas, he's not yours. I'm not going anywhere without that robot. Go away! Come back! They're stealing from a girl in a wheelchair. I said... No! What the heck is going on here? I love how he just... Is he a robot or is he a person? He's a person with a mask. What, what is your problem, kid? Look, over there, he dropped a Nexamon container. I bet he stole it too. We have to take it back. Hey, this is not yours. How are you so strong? Atlas, now's your chance. Yes, Mass Alley. I'm on my way. What is that dumb robot of yours gonna do? Yay! Looks like the W is blasting off again. Hey, quick, must take back the next one. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Who do I choose? There's Valazy. Oh, okay. Um, normal type rareness. What does rareness mean? What are these typings? Okay, we've got HP, star. I'm gonna guess that's stamina. Attack, defense, and speed. Okay. Not bad. Blizzo. Mineral time. So we've got normal mineral. Wind with Fetra. BV. Water. We've got Petril. With plant. Velokitty. Electric. And Sprunk. Fire. Oh my gosh, I only I didn't expect seven choices. Um Let's go with Fedra. Hey, what did you do to my partner? Forget it, I can deal with you on my own. Anyway, you don't stand a chance against my Nexomon. 
Hey, you was the next man, you just got to fight him. You know, the music and the graphics aren't that bad. Oh, hello. Okay, so we got stamina. Oh, and it really shows you everything. Radapon, eh? Can I look at there? No. So, bite. 35 at the time. 100% accuracy, 40% accuracy, that's annoying. Alright. Okay. Okay, I'm digging this, yo. Da -da -da. Mm -mm -mm. Ha! You got chomped. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, he died. That was amazing! No way! That was your first Nexum Hunt battle! But that's right, I should introduce you to my latest invention. This is Atlas. Hello there! Gonna love him, let me show you what he can do. What do we have here? He's the Nexo Lord. The greatest Nexo Mon Tamer in the world, indeed. And you must be, well, I don't think that matters, does it now? Even I cannot keep track of all the weaklings around this petty place. Jesus Christ, dude. Is that your Nexamon, kid? Does not belong to you, does it? Perhaps you believe you are worthy of using a Nexamon? Do you have what it takes to be a true tamer? Come on, kid, show me what you can do! Oh. Hm. You have the guts to steal from me. Why are you so frightened now? Keep that Nexamon, brat. Let it forever serve as a shameful reminder of how weak you are. Now, out of my way, if you will. Get up, scrub! Y yes, my lord! Very well, kids. Pray that we don't cross paths ever again. Yeah, he definitely seems evil. Just a little bit. Ha! Huh. What a nice gentleman. <laughs> ah, what is wrong with him? He's obviously planning something evil. Haven't you noticed anything weird about him? Like making the ground explode? He comes here all the time and must be related to the secret machine your parents are building. Maybe, maybe we can follow him? Are you crazy? Follow that guy? Come on now, this isn't a video game. Hey, this could be important. We should go. I think you're supposed to be the smart character in this story. Well, here's a smart idea. Let's, we should get another Nexomon. What? This way we won't have anything to fear while following the Nexo Lord. I'm sure Atlas can teach you how to capture a Nexomon. <sighs> I guess I owe you for saving me. <laughs> I love how it's begrudging. All right, follow me when you're ready. Well, he seems happy about it. Go ahead, you've always wanted to learn about Nexomon anyway. I will catch up with you later. I still like to point out that this guy somehow created a crater in the floor. Like, what? Alright, gotta keep an eye out for shinies. There are no shinies here. Cool. Oh, hey, you're finally here. How are you? Ready to get the new friend? Excellent. Come with me. Well, we saw it. You will need an exo trap. Here, take this. Cool. Now, let's see. Nexomon live virtually anywhere, but when they see tamers like yourself, they will try to hide. See that grass over there? Do you notice something strange about it? Mm, nope. Nothing weird about it. That's right. It is shaking. A Nexomon must be hiding there. If you approach it, the Nexomon will probably try to defend itself. That's when you will capture it. Go ahead. Approach it. 
Iran, eh? Okay, I guess I have to use the golden one. Okay, I guess you can't rename your Nexomon. I didn't even think about that. Nice. Well done! <laughs> hey, I see you finally got two Nexomon. Things should be easier now. Hmm. Nexomon you captured is a little exhausted from the battle, don't you think? Here, I got some items that can kill your Nexomon. Healing a Nexomon is really simple. Just open your menu and then apply the potions. Always keep your Nexomon healthy. Remember that most cities have a free healing center you can use. Are you ready now? Because I got a plan. I've lost track of the Nexolord, but there is another way to learn about him. There's a powerful tamer called Ivan who lives in Perum Town. He is an overseer. Overseers are great tamers chosen by the Nexo Lord himself. He must know something. Perum Town is really close. How about we pay Ivan a visit and ask him about the Nexo Lord? Let's go, let's go. It'll be fun to meet a powerful tamer. Be very careful out there, alright? I will contact you as soon as I learn more about the Nexo Lord, okay? I love how our parents are. S oh, our oh hold on. on Exposition. To the small town of Parham. They hope to meet Ivan, the overseer of that town, who might know something about the mysterious Nexolord. Okay, so it's like we have neglectful parents who just don't care what we're doing. Fleecius. Fleecius, more like Sleepius. Whoa, this is a mega rare? Alright, that did 12. That did 8. Oh, great, we're confused. Oh, no. Whoa, we get hit twice in a turn if we're confused? Oh my god, I'm, it's a mega rare. Go! Nexo trap! <laughs> oh man, I got new rules to learn. We got Felicius. Oh, hello. Okay, so this kind of has like a Coromon vibe to it, you know, like you can swap moves in and out. Info. Okay, you can see when they evolve, or not evolve, when they level up, okay. How much XP for it. What's this? I wish I could know more about the, you know, actual moves. Piercing thorns, and uh, just a pounch. Let's go heal real quick. Watch out, there are no healing centers nearby. Don't worry, I brought lots of medicine. Would you like me to heal your Benexomon? There you go. Oh, hello. So it's like, you don't really get random encounters here? Sakesia. Interesting. Slashing breath. Interesting. We don't know much about this game, like... I don't know what's strong against moves. I don't know what's weak against moves. We don't know anything yet. Like, we don't know the typing alignment. Nice.
These are cool designs, I will say. Wind, very effective against uh, plant, which would make plant not very effective against wind. Beast is normal. Got it. So here's a good question. Is this EXP for... Okay, so everyone gets a little bit of EXP. Like, close to none. Profile. Oh, shit. That's adorable. Database. What's this do? Oh, shit. This tells you when they evolve. Okay, Sakesia does not evolve. Ratpon does evolve. Baron evolves. Fleecius evolves. Hey, Fethro evolves at 16. Nice. So these two are much later in the 30s. Okay. Oh my god, it follows us. That's cool. Okay, interesting. Dandaloon. Twenty-two, very effective. You knocked me out! How dareth thee? Dun, 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 dun. So I think you're like asleep until you get hit by a move? Forty percent chance to hit, and all four sleeps that I've seen have hit. <laughs> Accuracy, my dudes. Do you know what you are? No, that's what I thought. <laughs> Dandy Loon, eh? I don't know, I don't even know what to do with all these Nexomon, to be honest. <laughs> do we, do we just keep catching them until we find like a cool team? Pandy Cub, like, what are you? I want you. Let's see, looks like Beast is uh, normal against Beast. I guess we'll go for a little bit. Just keep catching things. Like, I don't want to use our rare things until we come up against something that's like super ultra mega cool or something like that, you know? Pandy Cup, add it to the party. Thanks. Nurse. I don't know what else to call you, so you're just nurse. Pandy Cub does not evolve. Dandy Loon does. So I think we might just like keep catching things. Kind of get some levels, because I would assume we want a couple of levels for this game, obviously. And the fact that we're on a uh, stamina system again means we're gonna have to think about what's smart, you know. What kind of moves do we want to use? You know, just try to standardize things, you know, like, hey, one of these plus one of those would make sense than three of those, you know? So, Mustina! 15. All right, which would mean a tackle will not, or a bite will not kill. Ooh, that was closer than I wanted. Oh, 
That's the first fail. A 40% accuracy move that has failed once out of... Wow, now twice in a row. I had to complain about it, didn't I, guys? Man, why did I complain about it? <laughs> Three times in a row! Oh my god! I'm definitely in that mood of, like, gotta catch them all, you know? Hey, look at that. Alright. You don't evolve. Actually, let's move the people who don't evolve off of our team. Uh, Pandy Cub, you do not. Sino evolves at 21. Yeah, those two don't. We can really only catch one more normal. So. I'm very curious what happens if we run out of stamina, so. Oh, we get money for fighting too. Interesting. Oh, we unlocked Howling Winds. Great damage to opponents. Okay. Not that move. I wanted this button. Are my skills automatically? Okay, they are. Yes. Cool. I want to know, did, do our skills, like, automatically update? Hmm. That's a shame. It's so close to actually killing it, but just not close enough. Oh, great. Now we're killing them too fast. It's interesting how, like, you know... Hobbin? Hobnobbin, more like. Haha, <laughs> get it. You're so cute! You little Robin Hood, you! I'm assuming this operates off the same, like, idea of Pokemon. With the whole status mons are much easier to catch, so that's why we're trying to put them to sleep. As well as the weaker they are. We don't know yet. Well, I don't know yet. Hobbin. Hobbin Hood. Replace Pandicum. So does Hobbin have an evolution? We always gotta check this database. You do not. Well, that's lame. I mean, not everything should have an evolution, but like, I still want them to. Yo, we're getting some like, good amount of experience with these fights, which is nice. Pandy Cub, we can just kill it with two Wind Pelts. And then we're gonna gain a level here in a second. Look at that! Interesting. It doesn't seem like our stamina's going up right now. I wonder if there's a reason for that. Hold on, what's in here now? Interesting. Mastino. Just two wind pelts real quick. So you guys are gonna have to uh, give me um, your thoughts on this as we go. Cause obviously, you know, like, brand new monster tamer, monster catcher type deal, yo. So like, you could be like, oh man, this thing's cooler. Oh wow, this is definitely different. Let me uh, see some more of it. 
This does have a second game as well, so... If you're interested in it and you're kind of like, Man, I don't want it to end. Well, we could get another one. I've got several games that I'm going to be playing that are this-esque type deal. So I hope y'all are excited. And I'll tell you one thing. I certainly am. Shit, we might see Fedra evolve here soon. Um, the only reason I'm still, like, running around in here... Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's move on to the next area. We do need to level up our other, uh, Nexomon, but I might do that myself, too. Hmm, let me see now. If I'm not mistaken, to reach Ivan Sound, it's just a matter of going straight. Don't forget to try and catch more Mon Nexomon. Cool. Pentafon. Ah, oh, but we're out of... Ah, oh, screw it. We need all of the mons. Yes! Yes, we need them all! I don't even know what to do with this. At the party, Hobbin is no longer necessary because you are not anything I care about. Oops, wrong button. Please tell me you have an evolution, Ventomon. Vento Fawn. Yes, you do! Ha ha! Success! Now, if I see anything marked common, I will not. Common and uncommon, I will not use our special. But if it's rare, ultra rare, special, I definitely will. You see this thing, kid? In ancient times, a legendary hero built a system known as the Warp Totem. Warp Network. Use totems like this to travel and protect the whole world instantly. Unbelievable. Nowadays, these totems are useless as nobody knows how to restore their former power. Hey, what's this thing? There's a very vain aura inside, but I don't think there's anything we can do about it. Okay. Uncommon. Alpoca! I wonder what's strong against beasts. I'm sure we'll figure it out as we go. I'm going to assume electric is strong against us, so we need a counter to that. Gosh, I don't even know, like, what, what? <laughs> I have no sense for, like, the leveling system for this game. Just like with Koromon, I don't have any... I have nothing to, like, base off what a good amount of leveling is, what a bad amount of leveling is. Like, our stamina doesn't ever seem to go up. Hey, we learned Slash! Nice. I'm not seeing any shinyables, which is kind of sad, but also not surprising. I need more shinies, though, so I can catch more Nexomon. Ooh, level six. At this point, everything is one-shottable. Fethra skills. Bleh. Who are you? Hey! Are you a new tamer? Nibby should never wander too far from town since it's dangerous out here. Let me give you a little something. Money! Yay! Can I have balls or things? No. Looks like we got a trainer fight? 
tamer fight. Sorry, there are not trainers here. Well, damn, that was a strong attack. Go up here? No. Okay. Paralio. Wind, not super effective against it. Splash, not super effective against me. Good to know. Pandicum. Okay, interesting. Hey, you! I see you got yourself some next month. Show me what they can do. Come on, don't be shy. <laughs> I'm a Ricky Phil. Dun, 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 dun. Unfortunately for you, I'm a master Pokemon trainer and Coromon tamer and a master Dragon Quest monster tamer. Whoa, not bad at all. I guess I got a long way to go. Hold on. Balls? No. Ethers. Ethers. Etherway. Da, da, da. Cheryl! You're rare. I must capture you! Damn straight. Could we just rush our way to the first town and buy a bunch of these things and then come back? Sure! Where's the fun in that? So we got Cheryl on the squad. You take quite a while, Baron. Should I start using some of these other monsters? Probably. Hold on. First. Perlo. Oh wait, well, you didn't catch you. I want Cheryl. Level 14, hell yeah. Well, look at that, a new target for my new Nexomon. Heh, I'm on a win streak already. All right, kid, fight me. Are nuts. You are nuts. Ooh, I missed. How dare you punch me with your tail fist. Dandemil? Ooh. Cool look. You bound me! Wait, can I not attack? Oh. Wow. You set up, dude. Look at that. Rohan here set up on me. I got bound and slapped and then attacked. And then he died in one hit anyway. What? I can't believe this. You're not a rookie. There's no way. Hello, Paleo. We're close to running out of stamina, so I'm gonna try to sleep it. Now let's see what happens if we're out. We have to rest a turn. So it gives us 20. Okay. Interesting. Well. Then we gained a level. Terabyte. Is that like a play out words with terabytes? Alright. Wind. Very effective against ground? Really? Huh. Okay. Interesting. Didn't expect that. I was unexpected. I am, of course, categorizing all these different movesets and typings in my head. 
for use later when it is necessary. Alright, let's move on. Oh my god! Whoa, what's going on here? The room is a very dangerous tamers causing trouble everywhere. Oh, don't be afraid. What are the chances we'll ever run into one of them? Zero. No, not a... Right? Are you okay, sir? Help! Help! Not even the next... Oh, God knows what's going on. Antifreeze. Funny. Move on, kid. The next guard will take care of this. Here's a powerful tamer decided to burn up this area. We don't have any more. We don't have many leads, but he can't be that far. Another anti burn. How horrible! That terrible stranger set the whole place ablaze. They say people just like him have been wrecking havoc around the world. Well, that's terrible. Hold on. Looks like we're almost to town. A nexo trap! Yay, we can catch that thing. Well, you look very colorful, good sir. Shh, quiet! Zip, don't you dare interrupt the great Grandmaster De Rosso! Only with utter silence may I perfectly capture nature's beauty onto the canvas. Yeah, yeah. No, seriously, go away, kid. Yeah. Perfect silence. Yeah. An alpoca. Do we want an alpoca? We can save it for a better mon than an alpoca. I could just go north and... You know what? Now let's go north and go get some more uh, Nexo traps. And here we are. Perum Town. Perum, Perum. Did you know that each region in the world is ruled by a different overseer? Ivan is one of them and he lives in this town, so this is our chance to learn about the Nexo Lord. But before we look for him, you should visit this building. This is a healing center. Adventurers like you come here to he recover their Nexomon party. Not only that, but they also have a Nexo box storage where we can deposit and withdraw your Nexomon. I'm sure you'll capture lots of Nexomon, so you will be visiting this place a lot. After you're done with the healing center, we should go looking for a shop. Woo, money. Oh dear, you're another one of those tamers. There's a nice shop for adventurers that you like you down there. The owner's a strange fella, but he's got the nicest bargains. Hey, did you know that you can only carry six Nexomon at any time? If you capture another one, they're sent on their own. They're sent to your own personal Nexo box storage. Every healing center has one. Well, thank you. Hey, come here for a second. This console is what we call Nexo box storage. This is where you can deposit and withdraw your Nexomon. Cool. Great, let's keep moving. Tamers like you and me depend on healing centers just like this one. Well, Nexomon have been acting really aggressive lately. It's hard to keep your team safe nowadays. Really? It's pretty easy for me to keep my team safe. <sighs> uh, my entire PD was beaten by some rude guy outside town. There are lots of mean tamers out there looking for a challenge. Be careful. What? There's a vending machine and I can't even purchase anything? Rude. Did you hear some of the world's greatest scientists are disappearing? Not even the Nexo God knows what's going on. I'm just gonna stay here until they find the culprit. Shiny? No. Am I the only one who thinks there's something weird about the shop owner? There's something unnatural about him, but what is it? Let's see, Khan's jungle is a dangerous place, isn't it? I'll just grab a bunch of potions, that should do the trick. Uh, today, stamers are so reckless, they just want to bite Nexo traps instead of healing items. It's a dangerous world. Grab some potions. Hello, my friend. Need anything for your adventure? Come take a look.
Wow. Nice. See you around, kiddo. Wow. Nope. Perfectly normal shopkeep. All right. So I'm gonna end this right here for today. And uh, we're actually gonna come back for it on Thursday. Um, I will do some grinding up of our other team so that things like Cheryl, like kind of get everybody closer to our level. Um, let's see, hold on. Where does, what level does Fedra evolve? Fetra evolves at 16. So I'm gonna try to get everyone up to about like Cheryl evolves at 14. Uh, and the lion evolves at 24. 21. I'll figure something out. I don't plan on evolving anything that's like not in our party. Uh, I, 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 I don't know, actually. We'll figure something out as we go. Like, all these guys can evolve. So. Like I said, we'll figure it out as we go. But I'm gonna do some grinding. Kind of get our team up to about the same level 12. And in the process, I'll probably have to catch some more stuff. So expect a new team as well. <laughs> but, um, yeah. The only reason I'm doing that is because just trying to make sure we, like, stay on top of things and just keep episodes moving without me just kind of spending time grinding, but also getting to see all these cool new Nexomons and things. So, um, yeah. Anyway, this is where we're going to end it for today. So, thank you, everybody, for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. And until the next time, everybody, stay funker purple.